Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. This is your girl Irina J and I hope everyone is doing well today. Um, I'm back with another video. I hope you guys are proud of me. I'm doing this, um, putting this content out back to back. So I'm so happy about that. And I also want to say thank you so much. I finally reached um, 100. Now I'm over 100 subscribers subscribers so i am so grateful and um thank you guys um to thank you to everyone who has subscribed to my channel and watch my videos um i am so grateful and i thank you so much for your support um let me fix this camera i'm sorry guys there we go um so today we have a um I, want, I guess I want to say haul, but as you can tell in the title, I will be talking about um, some of my favorite Bath & Body Works um, sprays that I have in my collection that reminds me of um, perfumes to me. They kind of um, smell like perfumes, have that kind of like high-end luxury type of um, scent. Um, they're very, um, they last, they last very well on you throughout the day. Um, the longevity is kind of um, nice. It reminds you of a really good perfume. So these are, I have seven of them. These are the ones in my collection. Um, I don't know, I'm probably missing a couple of them, but these are the ones that I have that I in my collection that I think reminds me of um, like a really good high-end perfume or they perform like perfumes or something like that or the longevity is like a, a really good expensive perfume especially if you're a person that do, does not like to spend money on perfumes but you can get you a really nice good body spray um, that performs like a perfume you know especially with um, Bath & Body Works um, you know they have like sales all the time and they're like five six dollars or whatever for a spray versus like a hundred dollars or something for a perfume but anyways i'm gonna stop rambling and get into it um the first one i'm going to talk about is no other than in the stars yes guys in the stars is actually one of my it's my favorite one of my favorites i really really do like in the stars to me to me it's like in the same family as Baccarat Rouge 540, Ariana Grande Cloud, those type of um, notes are definitely um, is in, in the stars. And the longevity, and it projects very well, even the lotion. My mom, she just, she doesn't use the spray, but she uses the lotion, and she smells good all day and it's just by just in the stars lotion i remember we were somewhere we was in at&t and she just had on the lotion and the lady was like what do you have on and she actually went online and started ordering um in the stars just based off the lotion that my mom was wearing and it was in the stars so yes in the stars to me works very very well um, I don't know why I keep holding it up in the camera, y'all. Um, so the notes are starflower, sandalwood musk, sugared tangelo, white argwood, and radiant radiant amber. And you do get like the, those amber um, notes and just, I don't know how to explain it, guys. It's just, it just smells like money. In the stars to me just has this just very, very high-end luxury money type of scent. I love it. Like I said, the longevity, it, it, it projects very well. Um, I, I don't know what to say about it. it and this is very, this, it's a very sexy type of scent too. Very sexy. This is a great date night type of scent going on a date. This, this um, works very well for that. And it pairs very well with, I know a lot of people pair this well with um, Burberry Her. Because Bur Burberry Her is another scent like in that Baccarat Rouge type of family. It has those same, to me, type of notes. Um, so that with this, to me, pairs very well together. Um, like I said, this is a very great date night scent. Um, going out with the girls or whatever, in the stars to me, is good. For them. And during the day too. However you want to wear it, in the stars is that she, she's the one. Love that one. Um, this next one I'm going to talk about, I'm kindly, I'm kindly, what word is that, y'all? 
I am kind. I am new to this scent. Um, this is Pure Wonder. Here it is, and I love this bottle. I just love the gold and all that, or whatever. Um, Pure Wonder. I'm new to. Um, but I, I don't know. I guess I've been missing out all this time. I know it's not a new scent, but I don't know. I guess I've skipped over it, but I'm, I, I'm, I'm really loving this scent. Mmm. This is giving a very, this is giving like a fruity floral type of perfume scent. Um, scent. It is so, mm, it smells really good and it has like a, a and then a hint of like, um, a clean type of, I don't want to say soapy. It's not soapy, but you got a hint, little hint of like a soap, fruity, floral type of scent. It smells so good. Um, the notes on here is ice, jazz, ice rose, star jasmine, and warm white amber. I can't talk today right now. I don't know why. But anyways, this smells, like I said, this is lovely. This smells so good. I think I've been sleeping on this scent. I don't know why, but it is now like my new favorite. I love it. This is pure wonder. And this is a, like a a day to night scent anyway. But this kind of reminds you like a, I don't know. Like I said, it's like for, like I said, all of these are like perfume type of um, scents that I picked out. So you can wear these day and night, date night, going out, whatever is, this is another great scent as well. The next one I'm going to talk about is actually was another one of my favorites. I love, love, love this one. I will always try to keep this one in my collection. Is you're the one. Let me see what I got. You're the one smells so good. I gotta spray it again, guys. In the top. Mmm. This is heavy on the sweet. It's on the sweet, sugary side. Um, if you really don't really like like sweet sugary type of um, notes or scents you might not like you're the one but this one is heavy on that it smells so good this projects very well too this is very long lasting projects very well the notes on here is white birch velvety rose and a drop of strawberry nectar which you do kind of get that um, nectar that's where that fruit little fruitiness coming in too this smells so good guys i love you're the one and you don't have to go too heavy with you're the one too you don't need to like you know a hundred sprays or whatever you don't have to you can be kind of light with this because i'm telling you it it works i love you're the one um the, this next scent i'm kind of i'm new to this scent um i just bought the body cream or is it i mean not the body cream the body butter um, this is Poppy. Um, this smells like, okay, the notes on here is Fresh Morning Dew, Wild Poppies, Sugar, Sugared Rhubarb. Guys, is this, this word right here. Can you see it? Oh, there we go. Sugared, whatever that word is, that R word. And then <laughs> Juicy Pear. Now, this gives you like that, um, the Juicy Pear, um, notes are very are coming through in this it does smell like you can really smell the juiciness and the and the pear scent in this so it kind of reminds you of like a perfume that that's heavy in like pear scents um uh, i mean pear notes that's what this kind of smells like it smells really good it's very it's a like a very light airy type of um kind of remind you of like a very light airy type of perfume this is good for if you're that person that doesn't like heavy anything too heavy you don't like gourmand and nothing too sweet sugary all that you just like to smell like very light and pretty that's what poppy is it's a very pretty type of light type of smell it's not doing too much so i really like poppy um, another one um, that's new in my collection too that I think I was sleeping on is Dream Bright. Let's see that guys. Dream Bright. I'm, I was sleeping on the notes is sapphire berries, night blooming orchid, and crystallized vanilla. And I think you can really smell. Let me see if that vanilla like notes is coming through. 
Mm-hmm. You can definitely smell the vanilla in this with the with the berries. Mm, this smells really good. This also smells like a very luxury high-end perfume to me. This smells just like that. Mm, this smells really good. So if you don't have... Mm, guys, this smells so good because you can smell the berries and that vanilla. Uh, pairs very well together. So if um, you're looking for like a very nice um, perfume, high-end type of perfume scent, like I said, if you don't want to spend the money, I would say Dream Bright. Dream Bright smells so, so good. I love it. I also love the bottle, the little, little diamonds on it. Very pretty bottle. Smells amazing. Smells really, really good. So Dream Bright. Mm, I can't stop smelling that. Um, the next one um, is new too. I think all of these all of these must be new in my collection because I usually go, guys, I usually go for like Gourmand or, or like the fun type of scents. But now I'm, you know, I'm trying to get my grown woman on. So I'm, I'm liking the, um, like the more mature type of scents. And speaking of the word mature, uh, Rose, Rose is definitely a very, very type of mature type of scent. The notes is airy. Airy rose water, jasmine petals, and creamy musk. This to me has a very strong powdery type of scent. And but you know when it comes to rose, rose is a very mature. It can kind of come off as very very old ladyish, very mature. But to me, the this one, the rose. Well, I'm showing you all the top, but the rose is not doing too much. But it's very heavy on like a powdery. To me, on the powdery notes. To me it just come off as very powdery you can smell the rose but it's a it's very pretty it's not to me it doesn't it doesn't mind me like it's like too mature but and it's not doing too much but this smells really good this smells like a very good expensive perfume as well and i love it i can't stop smelling this one either so i absolutely love rose if you love rose if you love like rose type of um notes or like powdery type of um scents then you would like i would say you would love rose because rose smells very very nice I'm loving this one and the very last one not too long of a video um is a favorite this is no other than enter the night you know guys enter the night is a favorite it's a favorite of mine too this definitely works just like a perfume this is like a really rich dark type of sexy type of scent this is very much um nighttime daytime type of scent it just smells really good this works very well it projects very well the longevity of it is really really good i love into the night like i said it's an oldie but a goodie i love it you can't go wrong with into the night and the notes on here is raspberry nora amber crystals velvety rose Petals, creamy patchouli, and mocha musk. And you definitely smell like that patchouli and that musk. Mm, it smells so rich, so lux 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 luxury type of... This is a very luxury type of um, scent. Mm, I love it. This smells so good. And so, yeah, those are the seven um, body mints that I have from Bath & Body Works um, that are in my collection. To me that reminds me of like a very you know high-end expensive perfumes um like i said if you don't want to spend a ton of money on um perfumes you're not that type of girl I'm like uh -uh, i'm not doing that but you don't mind like spending a few dollars like i said you can catch bath and body works in their body care sales they have sales all the time to where they're like you know no more than six bucks or something for a spray um, and if they're going to, if they work and they work like a perfume and they last sometimes, you know, I'm not going to lie. They're not like, I won't say from day to night. Sometimes you may have to slip it in your purse and refresh yourself throughout the day. But Hey, for only a few bucks and you don't have to spend all that money for a perfume. I would say go with some of these scents that I talked about today and yeah, and that is it. Um, thank you for tuning in. And I will see you guys next time. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.